of Portland lost half a million dollars of a federal grant. And that money was meant to fund transportation services to take people to sobering centers. Joyce O'Geary digging deeper on how that funding fell through. The city of Portland applied for the $555,000 grant from the U.S. Bureau of Justice Assistance to create a service to take people to a new 24-7 sobering center. The transportation service community network for coordinated transportation would operate the vans. The mayor's office says it has taken longer for Multnomah County to stand up to this program. Since they couldn't act by a certain date, the funding lapsed. The communications director for Ted Wheeler, Cody Bowman, says, quote, our community desperately needs immediate stabilization resources, and we will continue working with our regional partners to help get these online. The money was awarded in September of last year. Multnomah County approved the funding to begin implementing pieces of the Behavioral Health Emergency Coordination Network services a few weeks ago. Multnomah County leaders have struggled to get more than $60 million of unexpected revenue out the door. Late last month, they approved nearly $7 million to build a 24-hour day stabilization center. During that meeting, Portland residents testified in favor of the center. The very few other detox options available are overwhelmed and people have to get on the waiting list to join them. And for so many people, one more minute of waiting for help is not going to cut it. In Portland, Joyce O'Geary, Coin 6 News.